Yes, there you go. We've just been going over 41 and a half minutes. Average frame time at the moment, just under 14 minutes. Now, let's see how Ronnie cues this one. You can't decelerate with those. Good shot. You've really got to get the cue through. It's interesting that shot there, Ronnie O'Sullivan played. Obviously, if he misses it, he presents Shaw Murphy with Eight. reds at the top of the table. It's very difficult Nine. to try to explain which shots at are the ones you have to go for and which ones you should leave alone. That's whether you're sitting in the commentary box, a fan, a player at home, or the players out on the table. We've all got different opinions. Sixteen. Twenty-five. Well, there's a loose red up near the blue, but he's got a nice angle, should he so wish to go into the reds here. I don't think it's one of these situations where you can guarantee. I don't know if the red just below the pink goes to the left corner. Ronnie's had a quick look at that. If not, I see value in playing the cannon here. Well, decided not to. So I can only assume that that red just below the pink does go. 32. And it does. to the left middle you would have thought I mean I know he's got he's low on this red here but well I suppose he could play it and think of opening up the reds but he wouldn't have a clue where the cue ball is going to finish well this is a big shot to take on it is quite a cutback I mean it's a frame winner if he pots it but it's a risk and I think correctly John then summing up this red in the middle pocket yeah this is the one for me I mean okay it's a tough pot but if you miss it you won't be bringing everything into play but he didn't miss it and he's going to be back on the block well, it looks like end of 147 if it's dead straight it'll be tough to keep the break going from here off the black if he has he got a fractional angle? Just Yeah, may be able to force it round off to a cushion, but it couldn't be very low on that red he turned down before. He's on it, but he won't be able to play on the black of it. He's a bit closer to the red. He can get his hand on the table or he's close close enough that it makes it a little bit easier this pot. And it goes, and he's on the pink. And this is snooker at his highest quality. A break-off shot. Didn't leave much. But now Sean is sat in his seat 
I'm looking at the mid-session interval and thinking I'm going to be 3-1 down. Only ever been 2 one four, six breaks at the Crucible, apparently. I remember Doug Mountjoy making a one four five. Mark Allen Graham got Well, he obviously had that written down somewhere. You're not going to... It was, a, it was a pot quiz question. Oh, I see. 56. Highest break at the moment, 136. Ding Jun Wei. It's going to be, it'll get broken. It's just win. Yeah, you're usually looking at 140 or above. 61. A little bit twitched in the twi between there. I'm going to give this red every due care and attention. Yeah, nicely played. 62. And control the cue ball perfectly. Quick glance at the scoreboard. This blue will put him 67 points in front, but there's still 75 remaining. So he's looking for a, another red. And that will put him 68 ahead. With 67. just 67 remaining. But he'd like to clear up here because this could be a good target. At the moment, there's a possible 1 4 2 if he took blacks off these uh, remaining reds. 68. But he's decided to play for the pink. That just means now that no way Sean Murphy will be coming back to the table. Good break this, Steve. Yeah, and also made without risk as well, forgetting any types of... 74. 147 prize money or anything like that. Win the frame at all costs. Looks, as we speak, very workmanlike, Ronnie O'Sullivan. Apart from his natural genius, which always makes him 82. look like a virtuoso. Yeah, workmanlike. I don't. Ronnie and workmanlike go together. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, the way he's, his attitude around the table more than, than his body language. Yeah, yeah. Playing the yeah. correct shot and not playing the expansive shots, if you like. That's what I hate about golf, you know, when I hit my best drive down the middle, you all go, steady, steady, Nine. my best shot. Well, he's played these absolutely wonderfully. <coughs> he's already made two centuries in the tournament so far. 97. 98. He could have made a 140, but... I don't think Ronnie's particularly interested in a high break. Wonderful stuff. Turn out, Turn out. Beautiful. 105. 139 was a possible. Not now. He's dropped down again. And it's 135. And what he said in the ice break was 136. Yeah, yeah, one. 110. He just wants to pot all the balls. And remember, if you pot all the balls, you're bound to win. Judging by the re reaction of his first round match against Gary Wilson, which was such a tough workout, I think there's only one thing on his mind. 117. And that's lifting the title two Mondays from now. To some degree, this man's been written off. 122. As not being so dominant. But when he's, when he's on top form, how could you write him off? Never. 128. Well, this is an absolutely superb break. Never looked in trouble. In there, the screwed it off to the right, and he did that as well. Yeah, the table completely. All the Sean Murphy did was break off. Sat down and enjoyed it with the rest of us. As Ronnie O'Sullivan makes a 1-2-8 break because he went in off, but he leads at the mid-session interval. 3-1.